Gary G with Inland Valley News here at Disneyland for a great press conference event in preparation for the Rose Bowl game on January 1 between the Stanford Cardinal and the Iowa Hawkeyes. Should be a great game. Stay tuned for some fantastic videos. We have Kevin Hogan, great quarterback here. What What's your feeling coming into this Rose Bowl? You're no stranger to the Rose Bowl. You've been here a couple of times. What's it going to take to come out victorious? Uh, it's going to take a lot. It's going to come down to execution and, and just working our game plan uh, to as much perfection as we can. Iowa's a great team. Uh, they do a lot of things very well. So uh, I think that if we just execute and, and put all the pieces together, we'll, we'll have a good game. Well, with the layoff entered into the Rose Bowl preparation, how do you feel physically? I feel great. This is the best I've felt all season. The coaches did a great job uh, giving us time to recover. The training staff did a great job uh, in, the, in the treatment room, getting our bodies back. And so I feel great. I know a lot of the guys are, are, are healthy now uh, after some season-long uh, little injuries, but I think as a team we're feeling great. Offensively, what's it going to take as far as the run game and the passing game? Talk about that combination as far as effectiveness, how to utilize it against the defense of Iowa. Well, we want to be as balanced as possible. We want, we love to run the ball. That's our, our bread and butter, and then throw the ball downfield. Uh, we want, we need to be good on third down and move the chains. And we've done a great job with that this year. We just need to keep it going. And uh, you know, if we keep that balance and, and we can, like, don't overload one or the other, then I think we'll uh, be in good shape. Talk about as far as your option to run. How, how much of that's going to come into play? If you can elaborate, or if you want to elaborate. Yeah, uh, I mean, you know, at times there, there are some quarterback runs, and, and uh, at times if, if the play breaks down, if there's coverage downfield, and, and I see a hole, then I'll, I'll be able to take off and run. And I feel, I feel confident in my ability to get a few yards and, and uh, avoid negative plays. So uh, if it's there, I would definitely feel comfortable taking off and running. What's going to be the X factor to this? game or anything you can think of and say okay this is what we're gonna do I mean I don't know without elaborating too much to reveal your your game plan but what do you think will be the X factors um, it's tough to say I mean uh, the football game starts up front so our offensive line it all begins with them and they've had a great season and I know they're very comfortable with our game plan heading into it and that's where we run is, is behind them they protect me in the passing game they open the holes for our running back so uh, we trust them and we know that they're prepared and can have a great game. Any team that you face that you can compare to to Iowa? Uh, I, I think uh, the last time we played uh, Michigan State uh, in the Rose Bowl two years ago would be a similar team. Just the style of defense. Uh, they do a great job of, of uh, you know, trying to lull the, lull the offense to sleep with uh, pretty much the same kind of coverages and, and fronts. And, and then they'll throw a blitz at you. So it's something that's very difficult because you have to stay locked in and focused. And, and uh, they do a great job at what they do. They're very well coached. So we're, we just have, it just comes down to our execution and uh, you know, if we can do well against them. What will it be for you in your, you know, ending your career at Stanford with a win in the Rose Bowl? Oh, it means mean everything. Uh, you know, we won uh, three years ago, and, and it was amazing. And to be able to come back and have the opportunity to win again here would mean the world. Uh, it's kind of our home away from home. And, uh, you know, to, to finish my career on on that great field, that uh, you know, heralded ground, it, it would be remarkable. Fantastic. January 1st, just putting, putting uh, 60 minutes up there and giving it all we got. Any special moments that, you know, before the season started, knowing that you'd wind up here? I'd say uh, after our first loss in Northwestern, we uh, got together as captains, uh, and we had a team meeting, and we just told everybody, hey, it's okay if we lose this one game, but no more. And we knew exactly where we wanted to get to, and we were able to accomplish those goals. So it's good to see everything come to fruition. What are your as far as assignments against Iowa? What are your thoughts as far as what's it going to take once you step out there? Um, I think it's just
just going to take a sound and solid game. I feel like Iowa is similar to the San Antonio Spurs in the fact that they don't beat themselves. you got to beat them. So it's just going to take another just solid game, everybody doing their job, everybody being in the right gaps and just playing Stanford Cardinal football. What's your motivation inspiration as a player and as a person? Uh, my motivation and inspiration is probably my family. Um, they've sacrificed so much for me to be in this opportunity to be here. So as long as I can just represent the name on the back of my jersey and represent that uh, Cardinal S in the front of my jersey, everything will work itself out. Well, give yourself and the team a big shout out, if you will. Give myself a shout out and the team. And the team, hey, shout out to Stanford Cardinal 2016 team, man. Hey, we did it. We're back here. Let's go ahead and win this Rose Bowl, man. Two for one, not one for two. Josh, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. I mean, I gotta say, I'm at the happiest place on earth today. I'm coming from uh, Washington State, so it was about 30 degrees cold, about to snow. So I come here, and I'm, I'm uh, wincing a little bit with the with the eyes and the sun, but you can't complain because there's too much sun outside, especially coming up from Washington. Well, when it comes down to business on the field, what's it going to be like as far as your adrenaline stepping out there knowing that, hey, we're, we're looking to be champions? Oh, yeah. I mean, growing up as a kid, you see the Rose Bowl. I mean, everyone, everybody in the nation watches the Rose Bowl. It's the granddaddy of them all, the Rose Parade, and the Rose Court, and the Tournament of Roses, hearing about all that. And to be able to come here and play in front of 110,000 people, and just that adrenaline pumping through, and having your friends next to you and your guys, and playing a great Iowa team. I mean, the adrenaline's definitely going to be pumping. It's not going to take much to get ready for this game. How was your Christmas? Oh, yeah, it was great. I had a great Christmas. Had the whole family back. My mom was happy to have all three of the kids in the house for, one, for at least for a couple days, so that was definitely awesome. How many family and friends are going to be here to support you? Oh, yeah, I'm going to have a lot of family and friends. My uh, grandma actually lives probably about five minutes away from the Rose Bowl. My parents grew up in Pasadena. My, my mom went to Pasadena High School. Dad went to John Muir. So the rivals, yeah, the turkey tussle is definitely a rival for them, but uh, it's going to be great having all my family down here and a lot of the relatives that we don't get to see in Washington having them coming to the game. Well. Right. As far as what makes you successful? What makes you great? I think just what makes me great is what makes everyone on Stanford team great. Just our work ethic. I mean, we're big, strong, fast, smart guys, and we all work together real well, and we all really balance each other out. Give yourself and the team a shout out, if you will. Oh, yeah. Hey, Stanford Cardinal, we're out here at Disneyland getting ready for the Rose Bowl, getting ready for the 2016 Rose Bowl. Let's go. Let's do it. All right. Great.